Hey, Nina here. Today I'm going to share with you my top three pancake stretches that will help you progress faster. So let's start. First exercise is pancake fold. So sit down, open legs as much as you can. And if you cannot sit here with straight back and you are here, this means your hamstrings are too tight. So sit on something higher and open legs here. Uh, so you can choose the yoga blocks or chair or whatever. Put hands behind your head. And now we're gonna do it with straight back. So slowly going forward and back up for 10 times. Yeah? You can also put hands overhead, but it's a bit harder. And go forward and up one. Keep straight back, forward and two. Do it slowly, keep straight legs and three, down and four, down and five, five more, down and six, down and seven, down and eight, down, nine, one more, and 10. Now go down and hold here. Hold, straight back, three, four, straight legs, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19 and 20 up. Okay, so all the time you need to keep straight back and engage your quads to keep straight legs. Second exercise is straddle up. So you can also do it on the chair if you are too tight or just sit on the floor. So you're gonna grab with hands here, lean forward, push away from the chair and come up in straight line. So here, rotate your pelvis backward, engage your core and slowly down, 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 lean forward, then put hands here and sit back. Yeah? So forward, push away, up, squeeze glutes, squeeze legs, engage your core and lean and slowly sit down too. And up, keeping straight back, Engage and slowly down, three and up, slowly up, straight legs, breathe and down, four and forward, feel the stretch in your inner thighs and hamstrings and down, five, five more, forward, up, engage, engage, and down, six and four, up, squeeze legs together and down, seven, three more forward, up, breathe and down, eight, straight back forward, up and down, slowly, 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 Nine, last one, up and slowly down. Take a rest a bit. Now we're gonna go up and hold there for 20, 30 seconds. Ready? And lean forward, go up and now hold it here. Here you need to rotate your pelvis backward, engage your core, squeeze glutes and keep straight legs and hold it here. So you really need to relax these inner muscles to go deeper into the stretch. Breathe. If you need for the balance something, you can put also box in front of you. Breathe. Five, four, three, two, one, and slowly back, slowly, 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 and sit back. If you are enjoying these stretches and if you want to achieve a front split as well, I made another video about that. 
click above to check that video out, okay? Let's move on to exercise number three. So put something soft under your knee. So first we're gonna go on left knee and right leg is out. Now go down as low as you can, down, down, down. So here your knees, hips and ankle should be in straight line. So if I turn like this, they are in straight line. So I'm not here or I'm not too much back. So from straight line here, go low as you can. And now we're gonna lean back slowly, slowly, slowly and up one lean and up two squeeze your core so you're not arched squeeze and up three do it slowly push 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 as low as you can and four back slowly and five five more back and six breathe Relax your inner muscles, seven, back, and eight, back, and nine, last one, back, and ten. Now hold, so lean back and just hold it here. Yeah? So you can turn your foot up, so you are really rotating also in your hips and it's more similar to pancake. Breathe, relax your inner muscles and try to push yourself lower and lower every few seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, and relax. So slowly relax together always come slowly out of the stretch and now turn sides so other leg here okay again in the straight line so knees hips and ankle go low as you can and now lean back slowly and up one lean and two Engage your core and three, keep straight leg and four, back slowly, slowly, deeper and five, back and six, breathe back and seven, slowly and eight, back and nine one more back and ten now lean and hold lean here turn your foot up so rotate in your hips up and breathe relax inner muscles still engaging core so you are not arched or you are not too much with rounded back so keeping straight back and five four three two one and slowly up and slowly legs together okay after that I also like to do bouncing in pancake so just go down or again sit higher on a box so open legs as much as you can and i advise you to have something in front of you to hold yourself and pull yourself deeper into the stretch or you can have a partner that will hold your back and just push you down okay now we're gonna go down just go as low as you can try not to have rounded back but really engaging your core your back muscles to keep your back straight and just bounce forward okay now you can hold for something in front of you so here and just pull yourself deeper into the stretch so let's go here 
and pull yourself deeper into the stretch. I can't do it without holding for something, but it will help you a lot. So just bouncing down, try to push your legs more and more apart. So here and bouncing again, slowly, gentle bouncing, keep straight knees, straight back and breathe in this position. If you are already flat in this position, you can also put some yoga blocks under your ankles. So, for example, put leg up and again go here with straight back, just reaching further, more forward, more, more, more. Yeah. So in pancake, foot is rotated up. Yeah? Don't turn it inside because then it's more a side split or a middle split. So you need to really rotate your hips outside. So foot is turned up. And hold for 30 seconds more. Just bounce. You can also go a bit from one side to the other side. It's up to you. Just feel the stretch. Breathe. Go more forward. It's also good to have like a line in front of you and you are trying to touch it more forward, more, 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 more. And a bit out to relax and again forward, more, go deeper, deeper, deeper and relax. And this will help you a lot. And five, four, three, two, one and slowly out. I hope you enjoyed my pancake stretches. If you want to progress faster in your pancake, I advise you to do this routine as frequently as possible. So at least four to six times per week. You can also do another round or two and you will feel your muscles are loosening up and you will go deeper into the stretch after each round. Stay consistent and give your body time to adapt. By the way, I've created a two months lower body flexibility program, which will help you to achieve a pancake, side split, pike and front split. Results from students are amazing no matter at which level you are. Click below this video for more info. If you have any questions, comment down below and I will do my best to reply to every one of you. If you are new to this channel, make sure to subscribe so you don't miss any new videos in the future. Thanks for joining me and I will see you next week. Bye!